Empirical provide compelling, interactive learning across a range of delivery options. Live on site, live online, or online anytime, we have a training course that is ideal for you. For a no-obligations chat about your training requirements, contact us at empirical.com. Front hall, mid hall and back hall is terminology related to the transport network associated with a centralised RAN deployment. Now in this context we have a 5G deployment but it could be applicable to 4G RAN deployments as well. So within a centralised deployment what you can actually see are three separate components of the radio access network. We've got the GNB because it's a 5G RAN node, so we've got a GNB centralised unit, a GNB distributed unit, and a GNB remote radio unit. And these elements will be positioned at different parts, geographical parts of the network. So the front hall, mid hall, back hall terminology is used to describe the transport network architecture that connects up these different elements. So between our core network itself and the centralised unit, that's where backhaul is positioned. Between the centralised unit and the distributed unit is where we have the term mid-haul. And then finally, between the distributed unit and the remote radio unit, we have front hall. Now just so you've got an idea of the actual transport network architecture, we've got a slightly different view here. And you can see it can potentially be a one-to-many relationship between these different network entities. So connecting up the 5G car network to the centralized units in the network, typically you will see deployed either a ring or a mesh type topology for the transport network. For mid-haul, so mid-haul will be allowing a centralized unit to connect to multiple distributed units, that would typically be deployed on a ring type topology. And then finally, we've got the front hall element, and this could potentially be a star topology or indeed a ring topology once again. And much of this infrastructure from the transport network perspective will potentially be deployed on optical fiber. Need to know more? Why not visit our store where you can choose from over 200 hours of video-based training? Alternatively, you can contact us to discuss any specific training requirements you may have. <laughs>